Over the years, paper chemistry has evolved uh, with use evolving, and that is the consumer. Business papers, they've all become much different than they were many years ago. We counted on the dot matrix paper to accept that one dot, and that was it. Now we, we count on high-end graphics uh, printed on 8.5 by 11 sheets, and we have to put it on with uh, minimal ink, with great graphic snap, and we do it out of the comfort of our, of our home office. That didn't exist 50 years ago. Now we're doing a lot more home officing. We do a lot of uh, things that we didn't do a long time ago. So we have, a, we have a good opportunity to continue that. What, what is also unique for this uh, uh, book is that uh, the chemical structures and uh, um, kinetic equations uh, and graphs are um, uh, presented along with um, published uh, uh, numerical values uh, that convey and um, uh, validate theoretical concepts. So now, based on this um, uh, data, uh, we can think at new concepts. You know, we, we, we can go further with uh, a new theoretical concept. The opportunity to write this book uh, allows us to showcase some of the talents that, that exist here in, in Georgia Pacific. Uh, we pride ourselves on being innovative and it allows us to demonstrate that. It, it, the book is, is really uh, different in that it uh, references many things that aren't referenced out there. There's a huge gap in the literature that's out there. There's many books on paper making, as you might imagine over the years, but it, it gives the opportunity to look at uh, technologies in a very unique manner. Our book is, uh, is different from the other uh, published so far because it uh, covers all the paper chemicals and um, um, the uh, number of references uh, is huge. Is, there are o over uh, 3,400 uh, references for this um, uh, book. The writing of this book allows us to showcase our skills inside of Georgia Pacific Chemicals to show the world what we do and what's out there. <laughs>